What's up, fam? It's your big bro, Joey. Welcome back to the channel. Much love and light to everybody out there. Hope you guys are having a blessed and wonderful day. All right. Thank y'all for being here. And um, did I say that already? I don't know. <laughs> but thank you guys for your continued love and support. I really do appreciate it, okay? I'm going to give you guys a message. Let me move this from the last reading. I'm gonna, I want to give you guys something from the fortune teller that we're going to see what's going on around us in the collective. Uh, before we get started, let's go ahead and just pull a message from, well, this is the first one I grabbed, a Fermi's. We're doing the Fermi's right now, baby. We're going to see uh, what we need to know right now from this deck. What we need to know from this deck, please. What do we need to know from, there we go. There we go. You flew over here. What we got, what we got, what we got. I'm a limited edition. And my alpha, <laughs> mofo. I'm a limited edition, mofo. You are one of a kind. Embrace that shit. Don't change for anyone. You'll lose your value. Stay minted, effing fresh. Period. Know that you guys. You, 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 you need. You feel me? You, some of y'all like, hey, unicorns. You feel me? I'm talking about unicorns in a good way. Like, you guys are unique. You're mystical. You guys are magical. <laughs> Why did I just hear that, yo? I just heard, they're magically delicious. Magically delicious. I don't know. Somebody think y'all magically delicious? What the hell is that? I don't know. But, yo, I just heard magically delicious. Wherever the hell that is coming from. We're going to go with it. But, yo, you guys are a limited edition. You're not like the rest. You're not like, you're not no, you know what I'm saying? You're not one of them. You're not, you're not one of them uh, regular, regular people. You ain't regular, whatever. You're not, you're not regular. You're a limited edition. There's not a thousand of you around here. There's one of you. You're a limited edition, you feel me? So people should be treating you like you're a limited edition. Like, you know what I'm saying? You're one of a kind. Embrace that and don't change for nobody. And don't let nobody think that and make you feel that, oh my God, you weird. Oh my God, you're too eccentric. Da, 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 who cares? You feel me? Because the ones who really matter is going to accept you for who you are. They're not going to be checking. Oh my God, you you shouldn't do this. Why do you say this? Why do you talk like that? Why do you da da da? They're not going to be doing all that. You feel me? Period. So you stay your original self. And you keep it moving because you're one of a kind. You're not a clone. You're not a sheep. You're not like everybody else. You feel me? Let's see what we got going on here for y'all. What's what's up? What's coming up? A new opportunity. It's going to be time for some help. Y'all receiving some help in some area. We had gambling in reverse. So some of y'all may have taken a gamble, but it's not going to hurt y'all. Some of y'all have, may have taken a gamble in the past in some area of your life, but it's not going to hurt you. Where somebody else might have taken a gamble and it might have hurt them, you feel me? Yeah, but you, you, you're you getting past that, over that, you feel me? That's leaving your life with decrease. Something's on the way down. Check the surrounding cars. You, you, it's on a decrease, right? You guys are about to receive some sort of help, okay? I don't know. This is going to be helpful for y'all to move forward in some area of your life. You will receive help when you need it the most. It will come at just the right time. Yeah, y'all about to y'all about to get back into motion, get back into action. It says time to get back in the game. A period of action and movement. It's showtime. Yeah, y'all about to move forward in your life in some area. And you're about to get some sort of help that's gonna help you to move forward, right? This could be divine intervention. This could be somebody, you know, in the physical helping you move forward as well, right? Because we have justice here. You will receive. Karmic justice from the wrongs done to you in the past. Wrongs are made right. That's why I told y'all that you may have taken a gamble on the wrong person, the wrong thing, the wrong place, situation, whatever. But it it was in reverse. So that's saying that it didn't it didn't like take you down to where you down. You can't get back up. You feel me? This is one of those. If it took you down, you jump and you hopping right back up. You getting right back into the game. You feel me? It's, it's not it's not uh, taking you out permanently. You feel me? Yeah, it's not doing that. So we have opportunity. A new opportunity is coming towards you. Okay? That's just help. 
And this opportunity, this doorway, this pathway is coming through to help you get back in the game. Help, I'm here to get back into your life. You feel me? Some of y'all have been experiencing health related issues due to um, uh, gaining weight. Okay. Some of y'all may have, may have, I'm hearing gaining weight and, and, and um, being bombarded with different energies. Okay. Not necessarily being able to cleanse all these energies off of you and it may have caused you negative effects to your body. Some of y'all may have gained weight, you feel me? And then you may have experienced um, health related issues with uh, due to uh, weight gain or eating the wrong foods or like I said, taking on the wrong energies, right? Sometimes we don't even realize that we hang around the wrong people they can negatively affect us. But that is going away, right? We're, we're this, this is decreasing. This is leaving you. This, whatever cycle that you was on, that cycle is ending, right? Whatever energies you were in, that is ending. Y'all getting y'all body. I'm hearing, I'm hearing y'all getting y'all bodies back. You feel me? You getting your body back. Energetically, physically. Y'all may be losing weight. Y'all may be doing spiritual cleanses, breaking spells and curses and stuff like that. Cutting soul ties to the wrong people. All right. And the reason why I say all that is because you got recovery right here. OK. You will bounce back from health related issues. And that was right next to the body talk. Which talks about extra weight gain. Extra weight might be gained. Uh. From a sedentary lifestyle or indulging in fattening foods. Okay. Yeah. And this could also correlate to your life um, taking a turn for the worse. Okay. But you, I'm hearing your comeback game about to be strong. You bouncing back. You bouncing back and making a full recovery from whatever it is that you was going through. Hmm. I see a full recovery for y'all. Let's see what else we got going on here. Let's pull let's pull some fortune reading cards. Let's pull some fortune reading cards here we got. So somebody needs to know that. Somebody may have uh, taken a blow to their self-esteem. I'm hearing somebody took a blow to their pockets. You feel me? We got marriage here. It says you are attracting emotional fulfillment and unconditional love. So some of y'all, it could have been, y'all, y'all, y'all love life could have taken a blow. Uh, your friends and support that you had around you may have been taking a blow. And now here you go with marriage, right? You guys are attracting a new opportunity to to uh, meet somebody who you can have a long term connection with. Meet somebody you could potentially have a marriage with. Some of y'all, if y'all lost your job, y'all could be meeting a potential employer who can employ you again and get that cash flow flowing back for you. Or meeting somebody who could... Uh, Give you some money making opportunities for yourself, right? Either way, something is coming together for you for your benefit. You getting your flowers. Look at this right here, y'all. Y'all getting y'all flowers. And what I mean by you getting your flowers, that means that you're getting the uh, the appreciation. You're getting the accolades. You're getting the uh, recognition, okay? You're getting the rewards that you deserve for the hard work that you've been putting into your, your life, your situation, uh, from the help that you've been giving to the collective, from all that stuff, you feel me? We got flowers. It's talking about being generous. Success and emotional fulfillment are yours. Y'all moving into emotion, success and emotional fulfillment, okay? That's why I say y'all take y'all y'all making a full recovery in your life. What else we got here? We got chariot. Charge ahead with confidence. Stay strong and focused. Charge ahead with confidence. Stay strong and focus. Right? Y'all moving forward. Spirit say, hold your head up high. I don't care what you've been through in the past. I don't care what these people did to you. I don't care what they took from you. Hold your head up high and you move forward with confidence. You stay strong and you stay focused on the prize. Stay focused on the end game, end goal. Whoever's done something to you is going they're going to receive their karma. But we that's not what this is all about. This is about you bouncing back and you getting back into the game. Right. So somebody I'm hearing you getting back on the horse. The world be open to new possibilities in all areas of your life. 
that is his new opportunity. It's confirmation uh, that's, that's confirming these new opportunities that are coming for you. The world be open to new possibilities in all areas of your life. Let's see what else we got here. Okay, we got two more. We got the sun. Open your heart to the enormous growth ahead. You guys are uh, embarking upon a new growth cycle for yourself, right? So like I said, what somebody took from you, it's going to be replaced with even better. Right? What they took from you, they took your dignity, your self-respect, your money, your stability. It's going to be replaced with something better that ain't nobody going to be able to take from you. Open your heart. To the enormous growth ahead. Okay, we got angels. You guys are surrounded by angels right now. You might not even know it that you're surrounded by angels. Your angels are guiding and protecting you on your spiritual journey. You're not alone. Y'all know what I'm hearing. Michael Jackson, you are not alone. I'm not even going to try to sing it. <laughs> That's what I'm hearing right now. Your angels are guiding and protecting you on your spiritual journey. All right. So keep your head up, keep your head up, yeah, keep your head up right now, okay? Let me pull something from this dream, Oracle, dream, 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 yeah, pull something from this dream, Oracle, what we got going on right here? What's going on? What we need to know, what we need to get from this, this Oracle? What information do we need, please, from this Oracle? <clears throat> Wow. Y'all being stripped naked right now. You feel me? Y'all being stripped naked. We got naked right here. Y'all being stripped naked of all this, 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 this toxic energy, right? All of this, this lack mentality, this, this, ooh, I'm, I'm hearing abuse. This, because I'm hearing, I'm sick and tired of all of your abuse. Yeah, yeah. I don't feel like singing right now, but y'all. Yeah, Sick and tired of your, of your abuse. You feel me? Uh, Y'all being stripped naked of all that. And you, your guys are, are receiving a clean slate right here. Y'all receiving a clean slate, baby. Childhood home. Remember where you're from and who you really are. Y'all being stripped naked of all these falsities. All these facades. All of this foolishness. All these things that were not true to who you are are authentic like people places and things situations you're being stripped naked of all of that so that you could come back down to the basics right all that's being stripped away from you so you can get back down to basics about to who you really are right because once you really once you know who you are where you come from that's when you know where you're going you feel me or where you can go and nobody could take that from you we got family Explore your sacred root system. This is childhood, home, and family. Y'all need to get back. I got this message in another other reading that I did. Another reading I just did was talking about ancestors, about you researching your ancestry, getting to know who you are, where you came from. You feel me? I'm telling y'all when you when you research your ancestry and you and you answer uh, uh, questions, it's a game changer. Nobody can tell you who the hell you are. Then you feel me? Once you research yourself, once you know yourself, right? Once you know your roots, and, and when I say know yourself, that's knowing who you are as well. Once you know yourself, once you know where you came from, and that's when you're going to know where you're going and can't nobody tell you shit about nothing. You feel me? Nobody can't tell, say nothing that's going to tear you down because nine times out of ten, it's not going to relate to the truth. You feel me? It's not going to relate to the truth. You stepping into that, it's like you doing your DNA ancestry test. You finding out every single thing, man. I'm not promoting that test because no offense to nobody. I know people love them kind of tests, but that shit is trash. You feel me? Uh, you got to do your research on that. You feel me? Do your research on it. But I digress. Once you know where you came from, it's, a, it's, it's this newfound sense of strength that you get, right? And nobody could take that from you. It answers, it brings light to mysteries, right? Some of y'all don't know where y'all came from, man. It's, and it's full of culture. It is full of traditions. It is full of pride. 
And y'all need to connect to that. I'm hearing somebody here needs to connect to that and let it be your source of strength. Okay? Let it be your source of pride even. That's when we come back down to some of that. That's how that's when we coming back down to I am a limited edition motherfucker. You are one of a kind. Embrace that shit. Don't change for anyone. You'll lose your value. Stay minted fucking fresh. That is what this card is saying, right? Because you're a limited edition. You're unique. You're a unique person within your own. You feel me? Card. We got card. It says get into the driver's seat of your life. Yeah, take control. You can't make this stuff up. It's time for you to take control. And this is taking control of what you answer to. Uh, what you think is possible for you. What you think is impossible for you. This is change. I'm hearing your life is going to go through drastic changes when it comes to your reality and what you, your, your, uh, your version of reality. And what you thought was possible, what you thought was capable for yourself and what rooms and what uh, crowds you thought you couldn't navigate through, but you can navigate through when you find this sense of self, when you find this pride within yourself, when you know who you are. You feel me? We have sex, kiss, hug. It says face and embrace all parts of yourself. You guys are going to be... Lean me fighting machines. I was going to lean me. Uh, I was going to say a lean me sex machine. Where the hell is that coming from, yo? I'm telling y'all, my soul, my spirit team be off the chain sometimes. And y'all know I still got to give it to y'all. Y'all give it. I, I, I tell you what it is. Even if it, even it's for, if it's for like jokes, you know what I'm saying? Face and embrace all parts of yourself. This is you. Being comfortable in the skin that you're in, especially in your um, intimate self-expression. You know what I'm saying? The way you express yourself in intimate uh, connections with people. You feel me? Some of us may have things where we don't want to experience or we don't want to let people into certain areas of our lives to experience certain things. But Spirit wants you to be stripped naked of all those limitations, of all those traumatic events that you may have experienced that may be holding you back from experiencing every part of yourself. You feel me? I'm hearing and indulging in every part of yourself. Or, yeah, ex you know, within, y'all know what I'm talking about. I'm not going through all of that damn laundry list. But, yo, it's like, so you guys can strip naked of all these deep-seated beliefs and, and things that were holding you back. Right? We're being stripped naked of all those things to create this new powerful version of ourselves that is authentic and that is one that has a firm foundation, one that is, is sure of who they are, where they came from, where they're going, you know, where they've been, where they're going. This is you being confident, loving, even. Uh, let me pull y'all something from, uh, let's go with, no, let's go with, let's go with the, um, life coaching oracle. And then I'm going to get ready to close it out. Yeah. What well, my message is talking about watches. Okay. It's my message is talking about watches. Invicta Watches is talking about um, a new month, new watch. And then the next one, <laughs> the next one talks about, <laughs> talks about working out and stuff like that. It talks about fixing your body and stuff like that, right? So this is us fixing our, 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 ourselves and, and, Fixing what was damaged, what was broken, you know? Having that karmic justice. So if somebody broke us in the past, we receiving karma, 
You know, we're receiving our justice for what was done to us in the past. You know what I'm saying? Let me clear some of this up right here. But this, this is a little bit too much. All right, y'all. Uh, let's see what we got here. Shooting star spiritual teacher was flipped over. We're going to go with those. Let's pick another one. Thank you. All right. <clears throat> All right. So we have approval number 16. It says, choose to approve of yourself and others will too. See, we see how this is all about self-confidence, about standing in your power. You guys need to be in that power. You need to be in that confidence because you guys are, are gearing up to be spiritual teachers. Number 20, it says you are being guided to step into your role as a spiritual teacher. That's why you're going through these changes. That is why you, you're, I'm hearing fast track. Some of y'all being fast tracked to get rid of this residual energy that's holding you back, right? So that you could be uh, stripped naked and get down to your, your who you really are, right? You can get down to the to the nitty gritty and get down to doing what, what you were meant to do here. You feel me? Standing in your power. We got 42, dark night of the soul. You are in the midst of a spiritual awakening. Things may be weird right now for y'all. Things may seem unfamiliar. Things may be, you may be feeling anxiety. You may be feeling uh, pain in your body. It could be show up in a, in a different number of ways. We have number 30, shooting star. You are sh a shooting star. You are about to step into your fullest potential. You see how this is lining up, y'all. Y'all about to step in y'all fullest potential. 33, recognition. Someone deserves to be recognized for all they do. People are going to recognize who you are. They're going to recognize that you are somebody who's powerful, that you are a religious authority, a spiritual authority, uh, educational authority, whatever it is. You feel me? That people can depend on you. They can learn from you, right? You have a lot to give, right? With this uh, generosity, right? Here, number 77. Giving from your heart with no strings attached is what is needed now. And then we have 22 creative projects. You will inspire many people through your creative projects, okay? Not only is it giving inspiration for you to actually accomplish and, and, and formulate these projects and, and, and bring them to fruition, it is also inspiring many people, okay? It is time to get things done. Make your creative projects a priority now, okay? Make your creative projects a priority now. Now get ready to move into this uh, uh, space of being a spiritual teacher. I'm gonna get y'all some soul tribe messages here and we'll close this one out. All right, we're gonna, with the Soul Tribe messages, you can, uh, the link is in the description box. What we got going on here? Get out and mingle, network. You're perfect the way you are. You see what I'm talking about? You're a limited edition. You see how that's, how that's coming around telling you're one of a kind? One of a kind. Don't change for nobody. You're perfect the way you are. It's time for you to get out and meet new people. Mingle. You know what I'm saying? Don't And don't worry. You're divinely protected as well. You're in the right place at the right time. Get back on track. Focus. Leave the past completely behind. And put in 100%. Give it all you got. And then we have love without regret. Okay? So that's what I got for y'all for y'all for this reading. If you like it, like the video, subscribe to the channel if you like to see more. And if this resonated for you, please comment in the comment section down below. And let me know how you feel about it, okay? Uh, much love and light to everybody. Thank y'all for being here, for being open to the messages, okay? Thank y'all. Y'all take care. Ciao.